I grew up into the culture, so I wanted my kids, them, even though they're born here, to get into the culture. My name is Ricardo Watson. I'm the second band leader here at Phoenix International. When I got involved, I said, let me do something. Since my child is here, that's when I got involved with the costume. And that was back in the 80s. Phoenix, stitches, and sew everything. And we got seven sewing machines here. As long as you got the design, December, I'm out there cutting them out. January, February, get my people them, start putting them together. I let them know the first thing I want done is the accessories. The accessories is either two or four for each person. If you have 50 person in a band, you know how many four pieces of that you have to make? These young ladies come all the way from the Bronx to do the work here. I could give them anything to do and I have to worry about them. Anybody else, I have to go back and look. The felt will cover, we put this in the back in the material so you feel comfortable when you put it on there. Mm -hmm. Well, the gems, we go to the city. 38th Street, between 7th and 8th Avenue. The two blocks from 42nd Street, you get everything you want. Feathers, trimming, but they're expensive. A pound of feathers is almost $600. Especially this week, you go there, you want to cry. You see that bottle of glue? It was $7, $8, now they're $13. They feel you have money. And they don't realize that sponsorship will help a lot of these bands. We don't have no sponsors, and people don't understand that. So when we do our thing, most of it's out of pocket. But whatever fundraising we have will help us. Well, we price the costume then by sections. Midline, backline, and frontline. Backline could be 150 to 200. Midline is 350, and frontline is 450 to 5. Depends on how loud it's a costume is. My pocket is empty right now. <laughs> we come out in the red, and it don't bother me one bit. You go to some other band, they charge you $600, $400, eh? It does that. See, we do here, we look at what's going on. We look at the economy. We look at people and see what they can afford and what they cannot afford. But we love it because of the culture. And if you love something, the money has something to do with it, it's going to look good. The most important thing out of those whole things is people enjoy themselves. Mm -hmm. We trying to make everybody sexy, but at the same time, to look decent. That energy stuff here, you don't feel it no more. And it's sad. You used to feel it a whole month before that. I don't like to use the word gentrification, but in this neighborhood, it was gentrified. I don't have nothing against it. But on this, side of the, on this side of the avenue from Eastern Parkway, you don't hear nothing, you don't feel the vibes or nothing. Crossing Eastern Parkway going down to Empire, you want to hear a party going on, that's where it's going to be. But this side, we're the only band on this side of the town. I got people coming to register from Bed-Stuy, and that's a long way. I got people coming from Long Island. Because every other mass camp is down Church Avenue, Flatbush, all that area. Before, it used to be all in this area. This is my last year. I'm tired. I'm supposed to get surgery on both of my hands. Copper tunnel, burning sensation in my hands. And I got a bend wire. It's the end for everything. And this is the end for me. 